matter than being a high school gym coach. I just love this life. Nice ah, shucks, Principal Vaughn. Why does she want with me now? Hello, Principal Vaughn. Hi, Coach Bob. Um, take a seat. We need to have a little chat about something. I'm a little scared. What's up? Oh, I'm just a little disappointed in the track uh, cross country team. You guys are just a little, a little slower in the past three years, and have actually come in last each time. Um, we'd like to see some improvements since we brought you on board. As well, the lunch line is so slow, and no one's even eating. I'm, I'm working on that now. There's been a lot of kids that are just eating all the food. I'm, I'm well aware of that. In regards to the cross country team, there's not a lot I can do when I have kids like Kirby that take forever. Coach Bob, you got any food left? No, Kirby, I don't have any food. Get out of here. You've already ate a week supply of it. All right, I'll see you cross country. See you cross country. Maybe if you work some a little harder. Well, it's only a sweet kid, but he just eats all the good food. But I'll work on it. Sounds good, because if I don't see improvements in the next couple of weeks, like we're going to have to fire you. After my talk with Principal Vaughn, I knew there were problems in the lunchroom, but I didn't know that they were really that bad. All right, I'll take um, a water. Thank you. you. And uh, pizza and chips, please. Pizza. Can I help you? Pizza. <laughs> Um, water, I guess. Okay, pizza. Uh, it's well, I ordered chips too. Well, ramen. I Coach, so about what's taking so long? I don't think so. Uh, just, you got any ramen? Oh, crap. Coach Bob, I need to eat. We're hey, I'm out of here. Hey, wait, 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 Ready, set, go. There's Herbie again. Coach, are we done yet? Can I go home now? After two weeks of not coming up with how to improve the lunch line or cross country team, I thought my day as a high school gym coach were over. One day at the annual high school gym coach convention in Kelowna, Iowa, I ran into my old high school gym coach who finally knocked some sense into me about this issue I had. This is the high school. Oh my hey, god. Bobby, oh, how you doing? It's been a while since <laughs> I knocked some sense while. in that's you. How you doing? And that's how I got inducted into the Gym Teacher Hall of Fame. Now, what were you telling me about earlier? The lunch line and Kirby? Yeah, they're just really performing slow right now. I don't know what I can do with it. All right, well, with the lunch line, you could add another worker. So instead of two, you could have three, and that'll increase capacity and your output rate for the lunch line. Another worker, he creates faster food. And with Kirby, have you tried putting him at the front of the line? I haven't. Well, you should try putting him at the front because you'll get all the other kids behind him motivating him to do better and go quicker. I'll, I'll definitely do that, Coach. Hey, Kirby. Hey, hey Coach, I'll take a Powerade, please. Here's a Powerade. Can I get a pizza? Yeah. Oh, wow, that was quick. Yeah, you wouldn't believe it would be increased capacity by adding another worker. Well, so things are uh, way more efficient. In that case, I'll take a Pop-Tart, um, chips, and a granola bar, please. Thank you. Quit eating all the food, Kirby. Come on, Kirby, keep going. Come on, you broke it, Kirby. We believe in you. I finally see what Coach Noah was telling me. If I put Kirby in the front of the line, people will motivate him to go faster, and he won't be the last one to finish anymore. Well, the lunch line's doing so much better, and so is the cross-country team, so it looks like you're keeping your job. Yeah.